from a PC or MacBook, all right, say you don't have Word on your computer, uh, this is what you need to do. So we're going to go to the lesson plan on my computer here. Uh, I just realized these PC instructions don't work. So where you're going to go is you are going to click on, I'm going to post that right here. I'll fix that later. But this is a link you need to go to. So I'll go ahead and click on this. All right. Enter in your username and password for the school, your school username, school password, and log on. Once you get logged on, we need to pretend like this is its own computer now. All right, so this is different than the computer you're actually working on. I know it's like a computer inside of computer, kind of crazy. Go ahead and log in to Chrome now. So it's Chrome inside of Chrome, which gets confusing because you're going to see double this. You have to make sure that you don't click on anything up here. All right, like I said, it gets a little confusing. Oh, I forgot to exit out. So you're not going to see all this junk. All right. So once you're in Chrome here, you're going to go ahead and type in the lesson plan. All right. I'm going to, uh, I'm going to try this. This might not work. Copy. Go back into my Chrome. All right, so I pasted it in there, and this will take me to the lesson plan for computer apps. All right, let's go ahead and make this screen a little bit bigger here. All right, so since here's my Chrome, I need to make sure I click on these three dots, customize, uh, some, some settings here. Click on these three dots and not these three dots. So I'm going to click inside my browser and go to settings. Once I'm in my settings, I'm going to click on advanced, go down to downloads, and I want to change this. All right. For you, the default setting is downloads, which I believe is somewhere up here. Um, you're going to click on this PC and then click on B ignore all. You're going to have your username. This is your H drive. You can access this from school, so it's easy to transfer files over because you can access it in the same place. So we'll select that folder. Once you're done there, we're going to X out. You can then go and download this file. There's two different places. Go ahead and click that. Click the download button in the top right-hand corner. It will load down here. Once that's loaded, you can go ahead and select the top here. Um, let's see, we need to disconnect. And then we are going to open up our Word. So every time you click on one of those, it opens up a different tab uh, for like it, like you just saw. I disconnected it, shut this tab down for Chrome. I went back to my Citrix receiver and then I opened up Word. You really could keep that tab open if you wanted to. Uh, so I'm going to go to open other, op, or, uh, open other Documents, go into my Browse, select my H drive, and I think this is also your H drive, yeah. Um, but I'll stay consistent. And then I have a lot of stuff in my H drive, you can see. I will scroll down to Y, Play in the ASHL, and Open, and there you have it. All right, all you have to do is click Enable Editing and we can edit our document now from our PC or computer. All right, there you go. Thanks for watching, guys.